Welcome to the seventh and final video in the Getting Set Up video series. In this video, we'll cover what each of the tabs do in the navigation bar that you see when you're inside of a project. So we'll first select a project. And then when you look at the top bar here, you can see there's a bunch of options. So when you select the ARB one, that will send you back to the home page. So we'll enter back into the project. And then on the summary page, you can just see information of your project. This shows you the location of your project and then information about your project. In the data tab, you can create sites, create new species, make soundscape composition classes, upload your recordings, work with your recordings, make training sets, make templates, and then create playlists. In the visualizer tab, you can browse through recordings, spectrograms, or soundscapes and listen to them. Validate the target species presence or absence and create training sets for the species specific identification models. In addition, identify the main source of the sounds that compose a soundscape. In the analysis tab, you can run species specific identification models, apply these models to your data, and create soundscapes and audio event detections. When you go to the jobs tab, you can view the progress of your analysis. And then in the settings tab, you can edit the project name, its description, and who it's shared with. 